Hi, in this activity, we will restore a configuration from a backup and then perform a new backup. Due to an equipment failure, a new router has been put in place. Unfortunately, backup configuration file has been saved to the TFTP server here. And now we are required to restore the file from the server to get the router back online as quickly as possible. So now on part 1, we establish the connectivity to the TFTP server and all the ports on the router are shut down. Now we use the PCA to turn it on. And uh, from PCA, click on the terminal and click OK. And I show IP in the fade brief to check for the, uh, the status of the interfaces. We have uh, 2 gigabit Ethernet and they are on down. The gigabit Ethernet 0 slash 0 and this is 0 slash 1. So I in the way no shot and the IP address for the gigabit zero slash zero I will get it from the server here, the default gateway. Oh, sorry, uh, the PCA, the so IP address, and paste here, and with the subnet mask. Okay, and uh, for the gigabit zero slash one, I will check for the configuration on the switch and show run or oh, no configuration for the gateway. So I think on PCA, I will get the or oh, this one. The default gateway here, I copy it and then I turn to the terminal and interface gigabit zero slot one no shut IP address paste here. Okay. So I copy, run, start to save the configuration on uh, the router. Okay. Now we test connectivity to the server. I will test uh, I, by using the Act Simple PDU from PCA to the TFTP server. The first packet failed. The second one is successful. So uh, the connectivity from PCA to the TFTP server is okay. Now on part two, we will transfer the configuration file from the TFTP server by using the command copy TFTP running config and add to the the remote hot is a the ip of the ttp server here the ip the server and the source file name we can enter the config of the router a and router a will uh, download it from the ttp uh, server okay now on uh, the router i Enter copy TFTP running config. 
and then enter the IP address of the uh, TFTP server one two two and the source file name router a t a router a config f f g destination file name the same okay now can you uh, you can see the name of the router has been changed to rta and we can show run uh, we have the password and uh, some configuration the bundle mode the, and some uh, provision that is uh, previous previously saved on the JTP and uh, issue the appropriate show command to display the interface status show IP interface brief and both interfaces are up and correct any issue related to interface problem and test connectivity from PCA and to the TFTP server the first one and the second one uh, that is uh, 0 slash 0 ok and 0 slot 1 0 slot 1 is ok then we test for the connectivity so it's successful now on part Three, we will back up configuration and iOS to TFTP server. Uh, firstly, we change the host name from router A to router A1 by using the command host name TA1 and save the configuration. Do, uh, do copy run start and then we copy the configuration to the TFTP server using this command copy run uh, TFTP do copy the IP and uh, the destination we keep it issue the command to display the files in flash as it show flash and here the system file on router two uh, on router a one router a one and uh, now we back up the iOS in flash to the TFTP server so I copy it copy and I copy flash TFTP the source file name I paste here the address the destination file name we keep it and it is uploading to the server and uh, now we check on the TFTP server uh, to find out uh, this system image file here the service TFTP and check for this one uh, M4B uh, 
So that is all for this activity. Thanks for watching.